<laughs> That's just me. That's just me. For that, you're in the video. You're in the video. From now on, you're in the... What are you eating? Oreos? Did you hear the goat? I was trying to do the goat. <laughs> the goat? Yeah. The Grinch goat. The go <laughs> I thought that was my... Okay, fair enough. It wasn't even close then, but still. It's supposed to be a scream. So give me your best scream. Redo. No, not redo. This is, this is con... The, you're stuck in the video now. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's right. You hide behind your cup. I was about to make a video. <laughs> I told her not to mind me. I'm going to work on a video. And then this is what she does. I love her for it. <laughs> I love you. Love you. Okay, folks. This is, this is going to be trying to get back into character. Excuse me. Just <clears throat> <coughs> <coughs> kidding. <laughs> <laughs> You know what, if there's someone who has, like, vomiting issues... <laughs> sympathy? Sympathy vomiting issues... This is going down hard. So it's always like, what in the world are you guys doing? <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I'm trying to sleep. Continue. Continue. I love you. Love you too. Thank you, baby. She, that was not planned, but I love when she does that. Okay. <sighs> Don't you dare. <laughs> okay, sorry. I can fix this. We have doors. Ah, nice. Now we have doors. <laughs> now we have doors. <laughs> All right. It's, it's, I, I can't. I can't do this. We're just gonna have to use this. I'm just gonna have to use this. I don't have any. <laughs> sorry. At least it wasn't a fart. <laughs> I really do love her. She's awesome. This is one of the things I love that she does in my stupid videos. This is why you guys like my content. Hit the like button. All right, I love you. This is my low-key ugly moment. <laughs> <laughs> I love you too. Have fun. I'm having fun now. Mm -hmm. I'm having fun now. Okay. <clears throat> Getting in character. Gotta think. Gotta think. Gotta. Okay. Here we go. I love you. Okay. No distractions this time, right? No distractions this time. Fair. Fair? Are we good? I'm eating my nutter butter. <laughs> you do your thing. <laughs> nutter butter. Yeah, she's got pe she's got peanuts on the roof of her mouth. She can't do it right now. We gotta go. You better be, you better X that out. Why? You can't you can't monetize when I'm mentioning brand names, can you? Yeah. But it's just a non-sponsored nutter butter of choice. There we go. See, I know how to fix this. Nice. Yeah, non-sponsored nutter butter okay. of choice. There we go. All right, let's do this. Oh. So I've been waiting for these comments to come in all day because I finally beat Riven. Finally, 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 finally beat Riven. No, missed three. I beat missed three. And now I want to check your comments and see what happened. Let me switch cameras and set up all my gear here so that we can do it the right way. Okay. All right. Let's do this. That's recording. That's recording. We don't need you anymore. Okay. All right. Headphones. I probably shouldn't take off my hat, but oh well. Okay, uh, it's time to see these comments. I want to see what you guys are saying about me finally beating this game. This has... Uh, I, I want to check on this really quickly here. How long have I played this game? So, Mist 3 Exile, I've played it for 16.4 hours. 16.4 hours, and I finally, finally, finally beat the game. Now I want to know what you guys have to say about this. And I am so excited. Because I know that, I know that, that it came as a surprise to me. I was not expecting at all to beat the game uh, th this soon. Because it took us, like, what? 40 hours for another game? 20, 25 to 40 hours, somewhere around. I know it's a lot of hours, but you get what I'm saying. It took a long time. So let's see here. We're going to go to our YouTube stats, and then we're going to go to our comments, and let's see. Um, all right. Abra Babylon, Lord of the Lost, says here, Nice work. I can't believe you did him dirty like that. LOL. 
I'm sure you have many games lined up to play, but I may recommend you may really like Event Zero. Okay, well, that's food for thought. Let's see what other ones we have here. Okay. Yeah, Savage Row was perfectly cast. I, I, re I really cannot imagine him played by anyone else. I agree. I, like others here, would highly suggest going back to getting the correct and... Correct and... Correct ending. I won't spoil it here since others have pretty much said how to get it, but it's a very compelling ending that you will not want to miss. I got all the endings. I had to have gotten all the endings. No. 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 I beat the game. No. There's not other endings. There can't be other endings. There's not other endings. There is no way that there... I found the best ending possible. The best ending possible is that Savage Row gets help from What's-His-Face, and What's-His-Face will go back and fix, maybe rewrite the book, maybe go and correct things. Savage Row gets his family back. That, that, that makes the most sense to me. And you're telling me there's a better ending than that? Really? What other options could there be? What other options could there be? Okay, we gotta find this out. Load game. Drop the bar. Here we are. The, the, the trick that we ended up doing was that I went up here. Right? I went up here and I turned this off. What is he gonna... Is he just gonna sit there? He's walking away. Where did he go? Should I just stay here? Is he just going to keep pacing there or what? He's just going to keep pacing there. I bet you that's a loop. What other options could there be? Because the best option was to lock him out so I don't die. He gives me back the book. And then I leave him here. The only thing that I haven't done is give him the benefit of the doubt. But he has not proven himself to me this whole time. Well, what if I got to lose? Oh, yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. No, no, no. Doesn't that just make you feel so good inside? No. 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 Is that the only word in your vocabulary? I feel like you've had a lot to say recently. So now the theory is I'm going to go back down here and get the book. Because he's going to give it to me right here. And then... Oh, I mean, God. I got nothing to lose, but we reopen it. We reopen the power and see what he does. Because we'll have relation. My family could still be alive out there. You've given me nothing. See, the, the thing is, right here, watch what he does now. This is why I don't want to help him. This is when he becomes a little idiot. Right here. Please. Just chill. Can't Just chill. Do this again. Just chill. Please. Just chill. Don't leave me Relax. here like this. Relax. I can't. You're turning into a baby. No! See? No! No! no I get no. I get it. I get it. No! Are you done being a baby? All right. Honestly, I get it. He's lost his family, and I get 
I mean, you, you guys can't blame me. You guys can't blame me for, me for choosing to do what I do. Because we see the alternate ending where he leaves me there to die. Let's give him the benefit of the doubt and see what happens. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why would you run that way? Why would you run that way? Whoa, whoa! You see? Do you see? How? Why? You're, s you're saying that there's another ending. That is the only... <clears throat> what do I do instead? You're saying that the other ending that I've missed... All right. Oh. Oh. Am I an idiot? I'm an idiot. So what we do first is we lock this one up. I'm an idiot. I did the wrong one. I honestly don't want to repeat this whole thing again. Can I skip past this animation? Okay. So here he is. I, I like his performance, but I don't need a repeat performance of his performance. Now he's going to give me the book. I'm going to skip past this animation. Sorry, guys. Here he is on his knees. We have the book. This is it. Right? Oh! Oh, I need to turn the power back on. That wasn't important. It's not until I turn the power back on. So, now that I've done this, now we turn the power back on. Which actually makes so much sense, because that leaves him locked out, but it gives him exactly what he wants. Oh, I didn't think of that. That's twisted. That's really twisted. Go away. Why didn't I think of that? Because I thought that the last move that I did was the only way to do this. I kind of forgot that you have you could turn the power and then repower it. My, my brain wasn't connecting through all that. So this is the true alternate ending. So great. He gets to be with his hopeful family now. What happens next? Am I free now to head back to, to Tamana and see what happens from here? I guess so. Okay, so the only option now, I assume, is that we go to Namana. I don't know how to speak English, because this isn't English. You're supposed to... Anyway, let's see what happens now. It is a much better ending, by far. It is a much, much better ending. Let's see what happens. Here we go. By the Maker, you've returned! Atris, Atris, come quick! The fire burned the linking book you used. We had no way of following thought. You've returned! But where's Relisha? Did you bring back the book? the ending or is there more what would really touch my heart at last I can rejoice a release has been returned to me unharmed the age I hoped would provide a new beginning still lives on I'm sure that no danger shall befall it and as I sit here writing in this journal 
I rejoice to know that Narayan too is safe. The secrets of its past have been unlocked, and old wrongs have finally been righted. I know now that we can't escape the past, nor can we rewrite it, hoping to lessen our pain. The best we can hope for is to continue to learn, to take from the past only that which is good, and move on. Perhaps in the process, we will build a brighter future. All right. Okay. Okay. Here we go. There we go. <sighs> By the way, a humongous thank you to all the amazing game developers who made this game incredible, incredible, incredible workmanship. Um, Presto Studios, Ubisoft, incredible folks, and then of course the original Cyan creators who put all this together. <sighs> All right. Wow. Wow. Shall we go back and celebrate by reading the rest of your comments, people? Let's go take a look here. Here we go. Let's go look at the rest. Uh, Camilla Ehrlich says, Humonga huge congratulations, Tim. Can't wait for Mist 4. Wow. Well done. Thank you. Now that we have the real ending, uh, everyone did an outstanding job of leaving comments. And yes, uh, I did see the post where, yes, absolutely, uh, whoever wrote it did put in a spoiler uh, notice, and I did see that spoiler notice, so um, I made sure to be very careful in reading on. So let's go ahead and continue here. Sean Hammond, one of our newest Legacy members. By the way, please let me shout out our Legacy members. Uh, Tony Allen, who's been with us nine months now as a Legacy member. Uh, actually, he upgraded to a Legacy member um, halfway through. Thank you so much, Tony Allen. Sean Hammond, uh, who just joined about three or four days ago. Uh, and then also our newest, uh, John... Uh, he, he, oh, he, her. Uh, hang on. I Herman. Herman. I got it this time. Herman. With two ends, I got it. Herman, thank you so much. Not John. Did I say John? I meant Jack. Jack Herman. Jack Herman. Jack Herman, you get extra attention on this one because I continue to forget your last name. Not because of that, because Hammond joined the day before you did, and it threw me off. I love you guys all, for the record. Okay, you're incredible. I'm so glad you're here. I hope you find it funny when I forget how to remember names. I apologize profusely. Don't leave. <laughs> All right, anyway, Sean Hammond says, Congrats on beating Miss 3. It's probably my favorite of the franchise, although Cyan wasn't actually the developer of this one. Presto Studios did an outstanding job crafting a sequel that fits the world and story of the franchise and arguably does uh, so even better than some of Cyan's own material, except for that one age. Uh, there are a few other variations of the ending, most of which involve meeting the head of Sav Savage Rose Hammer, but nothing I would recommend revisiting. As Jack mentions, though, there is one ending that is uh, better than the one you found. May or may not be worth a short video, but I would definitely recommend checking it out. Now, in saying that, I want to go read Jack's comment specifically. As we can see, he did put in a spoiler notice. You actually missed the best ending, in my opinion. To get it, after having him hand you the book through the gates, you then turn the handle and turn back on the power, allowing him to leave to his family while you have the book. Only a slight change to the end. You will you probably don't need to make another video uh, just for that, though. You know that we got to please everyone. There's If there is a beautiful ending like that, then we have to take care of everyone. Uh, I'm glad to watch this journey with you. It's been fun watching you rack your brain to solve puzzles, and I can't wait to see how your channel evolves. Thank you so much, Jack. I deeply appreciate it. And Tony uh, here says, uh, I would not have told him the direct spoiler without a spoiler warning, which I believe, I believe that was there unless he edited it after the fact. It does say edited here. I, I think we're okay, personally. Tony, thank you, though, uh, for for giving advice to to help us continue the the guessing game. You're basically trying to make my day harder, which I support. I'm totally okay with that. Thank you. He probably would want to figure it out on his own. Just a hint will suffice. Uh, my mistake. I thought I had used the spoiler emote. Uh, I must have removed it by accident. That's okay. No harm, no foul. Thank you so much to all of my Legacy members who've done an incredible job in leading me through this game. And uh, I deeply, deeply appreciate it. That aha moment when you saw the phases in the book after having half the puzzle locked down was so great. So exciting. That was from episode 16. Uh, there's a lot of other great comments. Uh, yep, your butt was wrong for the longest time. 
<laughs> this part of the game took me to the abs- uh, took me the absolute longest. That's from Jack on episode 16. Thanks for the sneeze. Can't wait to see you finish this. That's Jack Herman. Um, let's see what other ones we have here. Another hint. Remember, all these ages were designed by Atris to teach the concepts that the worlds work. This world, this room, is the final test to see if his sons learned the lessons he was trying to teach. Perhaps it's worth reviewing his journal, which is exactly what we needed to do. Well done, Sean, for that comment. Great job finishing Adana. Presto Studios did a wonderful job designing and creating these worlds, but for as creative as it is, Adana absolutely has the worst gameplay of all of them, maybe even all the ages in the franchise. Well, good. I hope we don't have to deal with that kind of junk ever again, because that was quite a room. Now, I got to admit, I would take on that room again in comparison to taking on the pain train. And I have already told you folks, if we make it to 50 channel members, right now we're at 28, which is our record that we've ever been at in, in channel members, if we get to a grand total of 50 channel members by hitting that join button and supporting the channel, I will play a speed run in the original Mist game. All right? Uh, and, and, and it's going to be awesome, and I will be dealing with the pain train again. And I can tell you, even though everyone says sound is important, I still don't completely understand how that works. Don't give me any hints. Because... Once we get to 50, and I'm sure we will at some point, may take a year or two, we will be playing Mist in a speed run again. And it's going to be quite interesting. And by then, I might have forgotten everything, and we might just be playing the original game as if I didn't. Uh, let's see. Oh, whoops. I misspelled John's name with a W. I fixed it in future videos, okay? I think I figured that out later, and then I'm so sorry. But yes, absolutely. We we got Sean with S-H-A-U-N. And if I did W again, I apologize in advance, okay? Yeah, these guys deserve to have their names spelled correctly. Technically, they're paying for it. <laughs> <laughs> if I missed anyone's comments, I apologize, and I deeply, deeply appreciate everything, 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 everything that you guys have done. So thank you so very, very much, uh, and I hope that you enjoyed our little attempt at acting and my little wife's jump in <laughs> in this video. I love when she does that. She thinks I'm annoying her, but I absolutely love when she does that. All right. We got to go. That's going to do it for this video, my friends. Keep it crispy. First Tim 412. I hope you enjoyed the actual alternate ending that I didn't think about because I was too narrow-minded thinking, hey, he'll be fine. No, Atris will help him out. It's all going to be okay. No, there was an actually, way, actually a way that we could help him out. Who knew? It's the thought that counts, and I had none, apparently. All right. I love you guys. God bless. We'll see you next time right here on Legacy Studio. Thanks for hanging out with me. Bye. Another end of an era. Now on to Mist 4. Crazy. Hopefully I get all the endings next time. <laughs>